the next question, uh, somebody actually personally phoned me to ask this question. He actually, I found it a little bit amusing as well. So uh, I will ask, I promise them I will ask on their behalf. They say that I give a lot of money in charity. Whenever somebody comes along, I pay them money. I never say no to anybody. But if I can show you my bank statement, my account is absolutely depleted. I'm feeling so low in terms of financial reserves that I thought charity increases wealth. It seems to me that my charity is diminishing. I'm not getting anything back in return. So I said, I'll, uh, you've asked the question. I'll put it forward and uh, see what the uh, situation is for yourself. You see, in the time of Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam, there were people when Prophet Islam announced uh, for to give uh, money for charity. Some people they gave charity a lot. For them, say Abu Bakr Siddiq radiallahu anhu, he gave all the wealth. There were a few other companions uh, who also came with a lot of wealth and everything. The, the Prophet Islam did not accept. He said, no, "No, you should keep that for your children and thing and etc." So, meaning that. Uh, it is according to the level of Iman. If a person will have, uh, uh, meaning raise quite after giving in the way of Allah, then you know, where will I eat, where will I eat. Look at the Rasulullah Sallallahu uh, his self-life. He was almost actually always in uh, debt because he was spending on good causes. But Allah Subhanahu was blessing him, but he was spending uh, and spending. So for people with weak Iman and thing, they should preserve, meaning their um, own, uh, you may say, funds for fulfilling their right, their family right, and whatever is, that's why the Quran have said, you know, whatever is there, for example, in savings, then zakat is in that. And if a person wants to give sadaqah, uh, but that does not mean that they should actually uh, utilize all the money, uh, which was the right of the wife, right of the children, or right of the parents, and then they, because that is also a uh, kind of sadqa, a person gets a reward uh, of that as well. Mm -hmm. And also, uh, a person should uh, see that uh, their wealth, uh, the spending uh, a person, uh, so that a person doesn't have a high expenditure, that his wealth is being given, but actually his uh, expenditure is so high, actually, it's so luxurious as such. Uh, this. And the reward is for dunya and uh, akhirah. So, inshallah, person reviews in the light of what I have said. And uh, with, uh, as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in the Quran, that my servants, they don't spend excessively, nor actually are stingy, the middle way. So, adopt the middle way, uh, actually. And then, inshallah, you will see the barakah of it.